even as cases climb, kids are still taking part in in-person learning at many elementary schools in Shasta County. Well, new at five, Action News Now reporter Anna Torreya shows us the plan to keep this from contributing to the spread of the infection. It's like the second first day of school. At least that's what teachers called it when their students finally came back to the classroom. Kids sitting at their desks, surrounded by their classmates, finally getting that in person learning they've been craving. Watching how they have come alive in class, it almost feels like school is a reward now. But there are still some hurdles that teachers are still trying to overcome. The difficult transitions are, you know, making sure the masks are always on and available and making sure that hands are always clean. And so I was saying before, it's about, it's about 20 to 30 extra minutes out of the day just to wash hands and make sure kids have masks. Because as coronavirus cases continue to climb, schools are trying to be proactive to prevent the spread of COVID-19. From, from cleaning the rooms, you know, we, we, we've, we've had our, our uh, maintenance and operations department make sure that we're using the proper chemicals. We're, we're being smart and, and we're, we're being proactive, um, working very hard to keep our kids in cohorts. Schools within the Enterprise Elementary School District started in person learning back in September, but the school district is still offering distance learning for families who are not yet comfortable. Reporting in Reading, Anna Torreya, Action News Now, coverage you can count on. Now, the Reading School District also started in person learning last week.